it's your girl LaCosta here. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel, Real Life Love and Me. Thank you so very much for stopping by to watch this video. Hopefully something said and or done in this video will lead you to hitting that subscribe button and becoming a part of my community. So as you see by the title of this particular video, I am finally doing a video on how I do my acrylic nails. In this video, video, I am doing the dip powder acrylic nails. So I'm going through all my steps to show you how I get my nails the way they are. So first I want to show you the basic items that I am going to be using or that I use all the time. First, there is the nail tips, of course. I purchased those from Dollar Tree, so I will link those down in the description of this video. Anything that I am using that I can find the links to, I'll leave it down there for you guys. Next, I have some fingernail polish remover. Then I have the rubber alcohol. I have the cotton swab pad. I have the super glue. I have a buffer and two nail filers. I have the drill file, I have cuticle oil, I have the top coat clear nail polish, and I also have the nail hardener nail polish. So these are the basic items that I always use whenever I am getting ready to do my own nails, whether it's just a regular polish or acrylic nails or whatever, these are my basic tools that I'm always going to use. All right, so I ordered this dip powder kit from Amazon. Again, I'll link it down in the bottom of the video for you. This comes with 27 pieces in all. 20 different shades of the dip powder. And if you've been following me for a while, you know your girl really loves glitter. I'm a glitter girl to the heart. So it comes with 20 different colors of dip powder. It comes with the four little small tubes of what I need to, you know, just keep the uh, acrylic powder in order for it to harden it and everything. So that's the brush saver. That is the activator. That is the top coat. And that is, I forgot what that is, but it's something else. I'll link everything down in the description, of course. But now I'm just going through looking at the different shades of dipping powder, glitter, and non-glitter, and everything. So, these are the instructions. If this is your first time doing anything like this, it is very important that you read the instructions. So, now I'm going in to trim my natural nails. I do this anytime I start a new set of nails and hey, it I just like doing that so it'll give my natural nails the opportunity to grow right. So just going in, trimming them and everything and then I'm going to go in and file them so it can be even all the way across. Don't want any snags or anything on my nail bed or my natural nails. So. Also, I'm not going to really talk to you guys through this whole entire video because as you see, it's pretty long. So some of the clips I have what I'm doing in there so you can see my whole entire process. So just enjoy the music that is being played in the video and also I hope this gives you some tips on doing your own nails. If you've been following me for a very long time you know i love long nails i'm a very long extra long nail girl so whenever i do my nails i'm going to have them long so if you don't like long nails then you have your nails the length that you prefer but for me i'm going to always do long nails so this is a clip of me just going in to remove any nail polish that I had on my nails whether it was clear or color which I didn't have any color on here I did have some clear on here 
and then I'm going to go in and use a different cotton pad to do the alcohol on it, rub the alcohol on it because it removes any natural oil that is on my nail bed. So, all right, that's enough talking for right now. I will come in some other parts of this video so you can um, hear me explain whatever is going on in that particular clip and everything. So, all right, you guys, I'll talk to you soon. Alright you guys, so I'm popping in very quickly to uh, explain what I am doing. With these nail tips that I purchased from Dollar Tree, there are several sizes in there. Some of my natural nails are wide and some of them are small. So this does take me a minute whenever I'm doing nail tips like this. It does take me a good little minute to make sure I am finding the right size for my nail because I don't want one nail to be wider or smaller than the nail that it's next to. So I am going through this process of picking out the right size nail. Now I did have to open up another packet because apparently I just couldn't find the right size of nail to use for 
my ring finger on my left hand. So putting on these type of nail tips, they're easy to put on and everything. And then of course, when you go in to file them, you're gonna file them to smooth them out to your natural bed. So if you don't want it to fit the actual full length of your natural nail, that's okay. But for me, I like it to fit all the way across on both sides. So as I mentioned, it took me a good little minute to do this, but you all are looking at it in the faster version. <laughs> so I've chosen all my nails out and everything, and now I'm just putting the rest of the nails back in the bag so I can save it to the next time I do my nails. I am putting the glue on now how I put my glue on I use the nail glue and I use the super glue I get the super glue from Dollar Tree some may not prefer using that however for me it holds wonders like it really keeps the nail on there and in place so I just put a dab of the nail glue that comes in you know like the press on nail packets I have a lot of those and a dab of the super glue and they just blend together and I put it at the very tip of my natural nail bed so it'll hold down and be in place I don't want it to go all the way down my nail once I put the nail on there with the glue I hold it down I count to 10 I move to my next nail very simple and very easy process.
y'all I'm back so this is the first step really in preparing to apply the powder to your nail so what I am using now is the base that is the number one thing the base coat is to absorb the dipping powder evenly and ensure a fast drying time it really does dry fast y'all like for real but well it really ain't no but anyway um <laughs> i have applied the base on there and as you see my nails are long so dipping it in it kind of was not working with me it was working against me so i had to use the brush early in this process but once i dipped it in I brushed off the excess besides that mess that I've made everywhere and I just went to the next nail using this powder I just did a single dip per nail and everything and I went back in to make it darker so I will have to repeat steps two three and four per their instructions to get them the shade of pink glitter that I wanted to so this is the process that I am doing right now. So now I'm getting ready to apply the activator. I only did one hand at a time, really. My dominant hand is the right hand. I'm right-handed. So I just went on and did my left hand first, and then I was going to move over to my right hand. But now I am applying the activator. The activator can harden all layers of powder without the UV lead lamp while allowing the colors to set quickly y'all it made it hard like <laughs> real quick i was very surprised at how quick it hardened the powder so it can kind of just all come together So it is now time to apply the top coat. I have done both nails. I've put the activator on both uh, hands of nails. And I also went in and did a little fouling down because I wanted it to have a smooth texture to it and everything and kind of went back and shaped everything the way that I wanted it to be. So here again, I am applying the top coat which gives you that shine over your nails and this does not take long to dry either you guys the top coat seals all layers to protect the nails from cracking creating shine and bringing you a long lasting effective listen this kit I would highly recommend this kit to anyone if you are a beginner and wanting to do your own nails and everything like I say the kit information is linked down there in the description of this video all right you guys that's it so now you know how i do my nails i hope you have enjoyed this video and again don't forget to subscribe like comment and share i'll talk to you guys later bye